the bear and the two friends. Hey, late for today's match? Hmm. No, I'm not coming. What? Not again. You promised to play for the team. If you break your promises so often, nobody will trust you and you will have no friends. Why do you say so? Okay then, let's listen to this story of the bear and the two friends and you will know why. Once there were two very good friends, Sam and Pete. One day they were traveling to the city together through a dense forest. It's better to travel together. We can take care of each other. Yes, we should promise to help each other no matter what. As they were eating and enjoying the natural beauty and peace, suddenly they spotted a big grizzly bear advancing towards them from a distance. Oh, the bear! Quick, climb onto the tree. Pete climbed up quickly to a tree and hid in the branches. I'm slipping. Please help me climb. Sorry, save yourself. Sam was taken aback at Pete's behavior. He quickly fell flat on the ground and laid still to save himself somehow from the bear. The bear came up and felt Sam with his snout and sniffed him all over. But Sam held his breath tight and pretended to be dead as a wood. As expected, the bear showed little interest in Sam, as bears do not touch a dead things. Showing no interest, the bear walked away from the spot. Then Pete climbed down the tree and looked at Sam. Did the bear whisper something in your ear? Sam smiled. You know, he gave me a great advice. Never trust a false friend who does not keep his promise and does not stand by you at times of danger. Saying so, Sam picked up his belongings and left towards the city, with Pete standing there all alone. So, we should try to keep our promises, right? Yes, we should try. Ready to play, Minu? Ha 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 ha!